Listen, can't you see? There, young fella. Run into any more pirates? Oh, that. That's just something Darkwater was working on. We sealed it off after he was killed. Best put it out of your mind. The bedrock of this island is filled with trillium ore. It creates too much electromagnetic interference for most ships. That beacon's our only way of hailing them. Mutiny, I suspect. Legend has it Slag dropped anchor in Moro Caverns and killed anybody who refused to call him captain, including old Darkwater. <laughs> Folks around here still like to scare the tourists with ghost stories about that place. There he is. Nice going. Pal, I heard there was a Lombax on the island, but I didn't believe it. What can I do you for? Afraid not. Looks like some bum stole the bolt straight off the power coupling. I can't connect the darn thing. Annoying for some people. Anyways, if you're looking to get a signal off the island, you'll have to find another bolt. I think I saw someone selling one down by the beach. Zony, huh? Come to think of it, all Angstrom used to jabber on about them. Said they were the watchers of the universe, or some such cobbledygook. Oh, a wise guy, huh? Yeah, make you feel big, picking on a working class Joe such as myself? For shame. Looks like it's missing a standard Grummel Net Versible. I'll check and see if I can find one in town. You check the beach. Well, howdy, friend. Now, what can I do for you? Well, what do you know? I happen to have one right here, procured by perfectly legal means, of course. Ah, with a crowbar! How about we make ourselves a deal? Here you go. I'll see you around, partner. Nice going, kid. Local Beacon Union 319 thanks you for your charitable contribution. Here we go. Just put this on <laughs> See if you can give it a good turn there, champ. I do it myself, but I'm on break. Union rules, you understand. I beat you. I beat you.
Young Lombax, I give you the Obsidian Eye, the most powerful Lorentzian telescope in the universe. It was created with lenses carved from obsidian glass and powered by a single Fulcrum star. Darkwater built it himself so as to keep in contact with his little friends. Can it tell me where they are? Well, sure, if they have a Fulcrum star to activate it. Here, I took the liberty of borrowing this from our archives. They're pages from Darkwater's personal journal. Cabin's log, the 3rd of August. My trip to the Breda's star cluster was fraught with savings. Not only did I find a great place for cheap crawl cobbler, but I also met a mysterious race called the Zuni. Friendly little creatures they are, can manipulate time and space to their will. Their leader gave me a fulcrum star I can use to talk to them with once I return to Polaris. It's worth a fortune, but I wouldn't part with it for all the boats in Meridian City. The only worry is me miserable first mate slag. It's only a matter of moons for he tries to pillage me property. But I've taken steps to defend it well into the afterlife using an ancient terachnoid incantation and a coupon for one free curse at the Hula of our Magic Emporium. I'll forever bind me soul to me body so that I may protect the Fulcrum Star. He who disturbs me shall disturb my entire crew. This I swear. Star ought to be locked away with the rest of Darkwater's treasure. Find that star, and you'll find your friend. Ratchet, I think I'm getting a signal. Rusty Pete to Lombax. I have crucial information about Captain Darkwater. I'm dropping anchor at the whole of our pier. Over and and out. Well, it's about you. time, mate. I've been radioing you all all night. So have you found the Obsidian Eye yet? Yeah, but it doesn't work. Darkwater hid the Fulcrum Star. Not surprising. Cheap old Bean Rake never did trust anyone. Of course, we were trying to kill him at the time. Good news is, every pirate worth their salt keeps a map to their buried treasure. A map? Well, where is it? Well, that's the bad news. It's probably still with his body over in Morrow Caverns. Tell you what, mate, why don't you let me help you find it? <laughs> Great! And I have just the pirate to help us. Ta-da! Ah! Uh, I call it Slag on a Stick. Rerouted his memory banks to his vocal processor, so he remember anything he's looking at. Now climb aboard, mateys, and put your faith in good old Captain Slag. And so, our hero set forth to Morrow Caverns in search of a map to the mythical Fulcrum Star. With him was Rusty Pete, a noble and true Corsair, adored by women across the galaxy. Ah, uh, this be a work of fiction. Do you even know where we're going? Of course I do. I got GPS. Look. Turn right at Isle of Despair. In five leagues, keep left. I love this thing. Hanukkah gift from me mom it was. Arriving at destination on right. Here we are, Morrow Caverns. Famous for its majestic fjords, soothing grottos, and legions of tortured souls awaiting their chance for revenge. What? Uh, what? I didn't say nothing. 
I still don't understand why we need Slag to find Darkwater. Didn't you help him hide the ship? Well, it was a bit soft at the time. Woke up three days later wearing an evening gown and spooning a kerchief. Ah, watch your tails! Thanks, Ratchet. Lumbax and Mulcadian, sitting in a tree. K-I-S-S-S-I-N. is so dangerous, so forbidden, that only a recitation of the fabled Song of the Dead shall open the way. I'm a little teapot, short and stout. Here is me handle, here is me spout.
like Reed, and you better be leaving, cause anyone left, I'll shoot! <laughs> well done! We knew you'd make it, didn't we, Captain? Thanks, mate. And now, for the secret password. Butterscotch, snickerdoodles. Should be real close. Dark water. I fought in many moons ago. Aye. It was the fairest battle in pirates in history. Still going with the shadow puppet thing? Darkwater's holding the map to the Fulcrum Star. Of course I am! Kinda wish I'd known it to time. That star would have bought a lot of grog. But a deal's a deal. <laughs> this path should take you along the forgotten shipping rails. <laughs> Good luck, Lombax. Me to get exactly what's coming to you.
first battle in pirating history. Right. Why don't you stand right there, mate? I'll check for booby traps. Booby traps? Isn't that a bit cliche? <laughs> Not at all, mate. After all, you're the boob, and here's the trap! I'll forever find Miss Ultimate Bunny. Cheers for the help, mate! Couldn't have gotten through the cabins without you! Sorry, old chum. What could I say? I'm a pirate! But here's a little something to show that there's no hard feelings. <laughs> Ahoy there, me hearty. This be Captain Slag, scourge of the galaxy, and... Dirty backstabbing no good take a tried. Dark water, ye got a lot of nerve possessing me. This be my body now. Watch your tongue, you made you old body snatcher, or I'll carve out your gizzard and fry it for me supper. Tough talk for a wee little phantasm. Oh, I'm a phantasm on account of you sticking this blade in me back, you miserable cheat. All right, enough. I think you two could do as a good pillaging. Set course for Holofar, our island. 